Hello everyone, it's Lurgs here. Welcome to my channel. And today, how to clip on the doors on an IKEA Pax wardrobe. This is the small metal hinges and the modern ones, they just actually clip on. Right, let's get cracking. Before we get started, there's a link above now about how to clean new PVC window frames so that they stay clean. This is one of the IKEA Pax wardrobe hinges here, which has already been fitted. And this is the actual wardrobe here. And this is one of the doors that we've got to fit and there are three hinges on here. And this door is extremely heavy and you will definitely need two people to fit this door. One person to hold the door up and another person to line up the hinges. This is what is bolted into the actual wardrobe and the clip that we're going to be fitting just pops around the back of here and then you pull it forwards. So this is the hinge actually on the door. And what you're doing is you're placing it slightly beyond the hinge, pushing it in and then pulling it back out again. And then it just literally just clips in. As I said before, you will need two people, one to hold the door and another one to line up the hinges. And there's a link above now about how to clean the inside of your thermos flask the easy way. As you can see, I'm just trying to line it up here. And this is a tricky job because not only have we got this one hinge here, we've also got the other two hinges, one at the top of the wardrobe and one at the bottom. So while you're lining this one up, you've also got to be aware of the other two as well. This is a bit of trial and error, as long as you get it beyond the hinge and then you're pulling it backwards. So you're going beyond, pushing it towards and then pulling back out again. It will seem like you're struggling, you're struggling, you're struggling, and then all of a sudden it will clip in. And there we go, we're in. And that is literally how it works. And there's a link above now about how to print multiple pictures on one page in Windows 10. And this is what it looks like after it is clipped in. So this is a view of it in place. And this is the door that we've just fitted. Now I did find with these wardrobes, when they're empty, if you open the doors, it will actually tip forward. It's okay once you've got lots of clothes and items inside the wardrobe, but it's a bit of a design flaw having really heavy doors because it will tip forward. And there's a link above now about how to check car fuses without having to pull them out using a multimeter. That's a really handy tip, especially if you've bought a second hand car and you don't know what the fuses are. And this is the IKEA Pax wardrobe mirror door that we've just fitted here. And I hope that you managed to fit yours fairly easily. If you found that video useful, please subscribe by pressing this button down here for more how to's, helpful tips and life hacks. And if you'd like to select any other videos around here, that would be really cool. And be sure to hit that bell notification tab. <laughs>